books to spice up your fall. Number one, the Twisted series. I think this is a great way to start getting into spicy books to see if this is your thing. And this is a series of four books. I've read them all and also my girls love the series. It's basically about a girl group of four and each book is about one of these girls and their love story. So it's always a different perspective, always a whole different story, but it's still a matching puzzle. Number two, if you love tragedy, if you love romance, you have to read Beautiful Grace. It's a very deep, intense love story that's tragic, but also beautiful at the same time. And it has some spicy scenes, but not too many. So it's also a great way to start with and getting into spicy books. <laughs> Number three, be prepared. The very bad series will drive you crazy. These books will mess up everything in your head. But big warning here, very bad is extremely spicy, extremely dark, dark romance and brutal. It's definitely not for everyone. And make sure to read the trigger warnings before. And I wouldn't recommend reading these books as a beginner. It's definitely for people that love dark romance and spicy books. Um, but if you also love stories with intrigue, elite universities, money, bad boys, I can recommend uh, them. But yeah, this series has nine books. I just have read the first four, but I guess I will definitely read the other five books too. The next book is also all about intrigue, money, CEOs, business. It reminds me a little bit of Dynasty, the TV series. It's called So Close and it has also some spicy scenes, but not too many. It goes a little bit into dark romance, but not as much as the very bad series. And um, it's definitely not a romantic love story, but if you love Dynasty, if you love those intrigue stories, family affairs, then I can recommend it. And last but not least, my all-time favorite, it's The Seven Husbands of Evelyn Hugo. It's a great way to start getting into spicy books. It's amazing. You can't stop reading it. And it reminds me a little bit of the story of Marilyn Monroe. And everyone that read this book just was obsessed with it. And I can definitely recommend it. <laughs>